Hello, this is PRM Taiwan and reporting from Saudi PPP, uh, from Saudi Arabia. Uh, today we have a great honor uh, to interview with Mr. Paul Grinnell. Uh, he is the COO of Res Expo. Hello, sir. Good afternoon. Uh, can you introduce yourself and your role in uh, Res Expo and Saudi PPP? Yeah, sure. Uh, my name is Paul Grinnell. As uh, you said, I'm the Chief Operating Officer for REC uh, and my role here is to help guide the direction of the company and its products and this show is one of them. Um, and uh, what we aim to do is to bring latest technologies, innovations and opportunities to the Saudi Arabian market and build brands and develop the marketplace into the future. Thank you. So this year uh, we see two exhibitions combined together and in that case I would like to ask what was the reason for that and what's the main focus of uh, Saudi PPP for this year? Well, uh, Saudi PPP is for uh, plastics and petrochemicals and print and packaging and what we want to do is to showcase the latest technologies, uh, the latest innovations and all of those existing and new opportunities within these, these industries so the marketplace in Saudi Arabia uh, can take the opportunity to meet with the suppliers and learn and find out what else is on the market and create a new economy based around those activities. Thank you. And comparing with the last year's exhibitions, uh, how would you evaluate this year's exhibitions when you compare them? Uh, well, we have the uh, fortunate opportunity that we hold this exhibition once every two years in Riyadh and once every two years in Jeddah. Um, and the exhibitions each year have always improved. Um, obviously, they reflect how the economy is doing because we are the market. Uh, but this year's edition is uh, grown by comparison to two years ago edition and the edition in Jeddah uh, also increased last year based on the, year, the two years before that. So we are making improvements and expanding but obviously in relation to the economy. Thank you. How would you evaluate the local market in terms of plastic and rubber industry? Uh, currently the market is really exciting. The uh, Saudi Arabian uh, marketplace has embraced recycling, renewable and uh, sustainable industry really, really well. And we've seen a lot more product and technology on the show floor for that aim than I ever anticipated. So I'm very excited for what the future brings. Uh, the market is a big consumer of packaging, print, petrochemicals and plastics, but there is a real appetite to develop from what they've used traditionally in single use into um, multiple use or even biodegradable product. So I'm very excited for the future. Thank you. What would you suggest to foreigner companies to invest in the local market? Um, I would definitely encourage it, not because I just would, because my company organizes a show for them, but the industry and the marketplace in Saudi Arabia is really strong at the moment and there's a huge appetite to engage with organizations that have new technology, that have innovation and that have uh, products that can benefit the environment because the Saudi industry and the kingdom is really keen to demonstrate that they want to make a change within their own country and benefit the rest of the world. So the economy here for overseas investors and uh, suppliers is very, very strong. And obviously we here at REC and Saudi PPP want to give you that opportunity to meet with the marketplace, exchange ideas and for sure give you the opportunity to do business. Thank you. And as we know, the next exhibition will be in Jeddah. So first of all, I would like to ask, what was the reason for that? Like, why do you uh, exhibit in different cities? Uh, depends on the different years. And uh, to make it wider, what's the future plan of Res Expo in terms of plastic and rubber industry? 
Um, there was a demand from the marketplace in Jeddah that we go there. Originally, the exhibition was every two years in Riyadh, uh, but that's simply because of the sustainability of the market and the, and the appetite of the customers. Uh, but it became obvious that there was an opportunity because they were asking us to have a, uh, an exhibition in Jeddah. So it was the right thing to do because the market dictated it. There is also a slightly different industry in Jeddah compared to the one in Riyadh or the eastern region and the western region. So it made sense to uh, open that opportunity and address it with the, com with the exhibition and the exhibitors that we brought with us. Okay, thank you so much, sir, uh, for the interview and giving us this chance. And uh, very nice to meet you. It's very glad pleasure. to nice to meet you. It's my pleasure, and thank you very much, and appreciate your time.